But understand that when you create muscle damage, the driving force that repairs it is the immune system. Uh, it does so by the action of the satellite cells. The satellite cells uh, will give their material to repair the damaged muscle cells. That's why when you have a weak immune system, either because of chronic stress elevation, because you've been sick for a while, uh, I don't know, maybe different reason, maybe because you're older, because as you're getting older, you have less satellite cells. You have less and less and less satellite cells, probably because of a decrease in growth hormone with aging. Uh, and that might be um, one of the main reasons for what we call aging, which is basically your body not being able to fully repair the cells, so, so they become more damaged and more damaged, and then you just, your, your organs, your skins, they just lose capacity, just become less and less and less effective. So, so as you're losing satellite cells with aging because of a decrease in growth hormone, uh, then you're not capable of repairing damage to your cells quite as fast. So, so when we're talking about immune system and muscle damage, uh, if you have a chronically elevated stress level, if you are getting older, uh, if you've been sick, or if you are sick at that moment, your capacity to repair muscle damage will be much lower. And you need to take that into consideration when designing training programs. 